Hey guys, Alex here, and uh, yeah, um, this is gonna be the uh, final reveal for our uh, our GM uh, Sniper 2 build, and um, I'm pretty excited with how it came out, um, to be honest. A um, couple hiccups here and there, um, I didn't slap on enough uh, top coats, so some of the paint scratched off, so uh, yeah, some... Uh, you know, there were some last minute, uh, you know, revisions and uh, touch-ups that I had to do, but uh, ultimately, I think it came out, uh, came out alright. Um, so, I guess I should, I should kind of go over the colors that I used. Um, so, with the whole setup as far as, um, as far as this kit goes, um, there was very, there's not a whole lot of, um, uh, you know modification that went into the actual kit um, so pretty much uh, I'll probably put the the colors in the description but um so yeah as far as the colors go um, there was a base three colors that I've used for a lot of the a lot of the armor parts were basically um, uh, mr. color dark sea gray um, uh, dark sea gray for a lot of the parts such as the like the arms the shoulders and the the knee parts um, the uh, the darker gray color that we have here on the, on the leg armor parts uh, the feet as well as the uh, you know some of the side skirts uh, the front skirts and stuff um, this this is a uh, Gaia Gaia notes uh, German gray um, it's a little bit too dark for my taste. Um, you can probably see the colors fairly well in the light, but just in natural lighting, it's a little bit darker than uh, than what I'm I'm fairly comfortable with, I suppose. Um, uh, parts of the feet were painted in a metallic black. Um, uh, a Mr. Hobby, Mr. Hobby, metallic black for the for the feet. So just you know, um, gunmetal for I, I used a IPP uh, gunmetal for the in inner frame so you can kind of see see the inner frame colors uh coming in through the you know the vents and the the bottoms of the feet as well but um those are the those are basically the three main colors um uh there were a couple of uh additions i suppose um accents as far as uh the weapons and things like that go um most of the weapons are gunmetal um this uh lighter shade of um Gun metal over here is actually um, that's Tamiya spray paint that I I decanted, so that's that's the lighter silvery gun metal, and then this is the IPP uh, gun metal that I used for the weapon. Um, so these are basically the same thing. Um, and as far as the modifications for the rifle go, if you've been following my my work some my work in progress videos. Um, yeah, it was basically a very, very simple project um, as far as the rifle goes. Um, basically, I took off the the muzzle portion and I elongated the existing barrel um, and just added these notches for um, you know, kind of like a compensator effect. Um, so uh, yeah, it's it's fairly uh, it's fairly long. Um, looks pretty good, I'd say. And um, I mean, not my best work, but, uh, I mean, not, not bad, I suppose, um, but yeah, most of this is a mix of, like, gunmetal, different gunmetals, and, uh, guy knows star bright, ar uh, star, star bright iron, well, that was kind of a tongue twister there, so, yeah, that's about it, and as far as, as far as the shield goes, um, same thing, um, we have the, um, we have the German Grey, and this is Midnight Blue. Um, that's pretty much the other color that you see here uh, on the armor, the the uh, Mr. Hobby uh, Midnight Blue. So, um, yeah, so Gaia Notes, German Grey, uh, Mr. Hobby, uh, Midnight Blue, and uh, Neutral Grey 5, and uh, Metallic Black, and IPP Gunmetal, that's about it, and, you know, just little bits of decanted Tamiya can spray uh, gunmetal as well. So to briefly just cover the decals, um, I basically used most of the uh, water, sli uh, water slides from Haikyuu as well as the uh, dry transfers from the uh, from the, the kit originally, um, like the EFSF uh, logos and stuff. 
I prefer water slides just because uh, they're easier to apply than decals. But um, as far as the uh, you know the choice in which uh, uh, what decals I used, uh, they were basically just whatever I found would fit. Um, the the 21 up there um, is actually the the date of my birth. So um, my birthday is January 21st. So I just figured it's, I'd stick a two and a one on there. So um, so yeah. But that's about it. Um, there's no actually all actual other meaning to uh, any of the other decals or anything. So I think that just about wraps up my. Uh, reveal as far as uh, this video goes and uh, hopefully um, you guys enjoyed the ride as far as um, you know how we got here uh, to this point so um, once again thank you so much for uh, following and uh, you know really just you know joining in on the live streams and all that stuff so I'm really uh, really happy with the direction that the channel is going and uh, I hope that I can uh, I can find uh, more great content and uh, be able to create more great content for me to share with you guys. So, uh, once again, thanks for all the support. Um, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. If you didn't like it, give it a thumbs down. Um, drop me a comment if you'd like. Um, I also have a Facebook page for things that are not in my videos um, down in the description. And uh, special thanks to Zach or Zach Aurelius uh, for letting me, uh, you know, crash his pad and uh, hang out for the day and. Uh, Make some content here for you guys so um yeah uh, if you're not subscribed to his channel it's zaku aurelius um link also in the description and uh so i'll kind of give you some uh some you know some shots of uh of this kit posed up and uh we'll start the montage okay